may mean touching and being touched. You may be required by your tutor to demonstrate that you are physically able to perform set first aid tasks. It's important that you're on time for all course sessions. If you're not able to attend all course sessions, you may not be able to obtain your certificate. Your tutor will provide you with any material you may need for your course. I would really encourage you to buy a St John First Aid Handbook as it's a great reference book. Ask your tutor if you'd like to buy a handbook. Mobile phone calls and texts can be disruptive to the class. Please avoid making or receiving phone calls or sending text messages during session times unless it's an emergency. I recommend you switch your phone off or use silent mode. Your tutor will now take you through the requirements for this venue. Thank you for listening and enjoy your course. Now, you know this venue. Wake up, I call the police. Call the police. Right, mate. Right, you have your food pipe, and then the stomach, that little bag. The stomach doesn't want to be empty. Because how it digests your food is by squirting or something in it. And now, now it's coming out. Could be a little bit, could be a lot, right? And if it's a lot, it could kill them. That's passed out to patients. That's why we need to roll them over. Yeah. Did you find that um, lifting the knees makes them lighter? Yeah. 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 See, paramedics figure out how to yeah. do the job more lightly. Yeah. I'm sure that builders, carpenters, and you do that too, eh? Yeah. What's easiest? Yeah, so lifting both of these. However, if tomorrow you forget how... Wow. Bye, Paul. 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 Bye,